Guys, on today's tutorial, we're gonna be looking at command line tools, the update that just came out for 10.10.3. Okay, so to get to it, um, basically you just have to you can go up here, for example, and look up your app store. Okay, so you can search for that, open that up, and then you're gonna go into updates and see this. If you don't see it there for some reason, you should see it once you click on Apple. On your Apple, you should see on your third option, it would be right there. So it should say one new and that's your update so it should load up this page if it doesn't once again just click on the fourth option right here i mean fifth option which is updates and from here you just have to click on update or you can click on update all now what does this update do well it updates all this okay um basically you do have to do these updates because your computer you will see that sometimes they start running slow and so on so it's better just to go with the updates that happen um, and always um, although I also I do recommend usually just doing them right away um, for big updates such as this one this one's a little bit bigger for this type of update always wait till somebody says something about it okay if it's approved by somebody else then that means it's safe to do so sometimes updates do come with glitches and some come with major glitches so you have to wait till somebody else does it and they see if they run into problems or anything like that and then you do it okay so that's why I'm making this video I already did it on my other Macs and that's why I'm doing it in this Mac right now just to show you guys that it's safe to do so and proceed on so we're just gonna agree onto it agree again agree again and then download and restart so make sure to save all your projects everything on your computer do a time machine backup of your computer before any updates of course just in case and that's it for this video okay right now we're just gonna see the screen going black and then it's gonna load up again and it shouldn't take more than 30 minutes if you have slow internet okay so that's it for this video if you guys have any questions comments you can write them here below and don't forget to subscribe and rate thank you